Out of a hundred rappers, there's like five Asian American rappers. There aren't many Asian rappers doing it. You'll hear Asian rappers that sound Asian. What's this whole business about sounding black? Dude, it's so frustrating. Aquafina has a booking agent. I've been trying to do that for like the last five years. A cute Asian girl who has like catchy hipster songs, like you know how to sell that. Yo, veg, look like Tony it's like the hip-hop elitists that want to tear me down because like they're not used to seeing a little diminutive Asian girl. There's nothing better than being underestimated. You never see an Asian that's really being innovative ever complain about how unfair it is. Like I'm Superman. I'm not just a rapper, I'm an activist. They expect us to be that modern minority. We need that champion. We need to be better than everybody. I don't think that I'm a spokesperson for Asian Americans at all, but I think that when I'm out there, I'm representing them. Fuck stereotype, you know? Fuck what you expect. This is who I am. Mama had a dream, but she gave it up to me. And my sister raising kids, man, that ain't a cup of tea. Now she ain't got no cheese. I know it's the music because everything else, dude, I could hold down, bro. You up for dumbfounded? Dumbfounded can do it. If he steps his it shit up just a little bit more. And I'm like staring at the whole time. I'm just trying to make my mark in, in hip hop and music. A lot of those cats would love to be in my position, so I I, I can't take this for granted. Tell me mama only there yet. Hello, my name's Salima. I'm a filmmaker from California. What's up? My name's Jay Key. I'm a writer, manager, and a producer from Queens, New York. We hope you guys enjoyed the trailer. It's a film Jay Key and I have been working on for the past year and a half. It's a film about four rap artists attempting to succeed in a field that's essentially rooted in black culture. And over the years, there have been Asian rap artists in the United States that were recognized, but nobody's been able to become a household name. So with this film, we're trying to explore a story that's never been told. Some of these artists are on the verge of blowing up. One of them could actually be the next Macklemore. In the sense that they could reach widespread commercial success and still maintain independence and shed light on subjects that weren't explored in mainstream rap in the past. But why hasn't there been a success story? Is it the talent, lack of support, their appearance, or just not having that IT record yet. Now, aside from the characters highlighted in the trailer, we've spoken to the first Asian American rap artist with mainstream recognition, first Asian American rap group to top the Billboard charts, YouTube sensation, even an international K-pop star, and a lot more. So here's the part where we need your support. We've been working on this film solely with our own budget, with no outside funding. We were able to create a 40 minute short that we are proud of. Yes, and this means that we have to have more production, more footage and interviews we need to get to tell a better story, as well as funding for equipment, manpower, and travel. It was Jake and I running around with one or two cameras. We made rigs out of like string. Imagine what we could do if we had your help, your support. So with that said, if you enjoy the trailer and would love to see this film in its entirety, please give us a helping hand. If you wish to know more about us, the characters, and of course, Bad Rap, the film, more information is available on our Indiegogo page. Thank you. Peace.